Well, this is pretty cool being back at Boston College. Graduated in 1980 with a major in communications. And I'm going to get a chance to meet a young man by the name of John Johnson. He plays free safety at Boston College. And picked off by John Johnson! A position I played 35 years ago here. And the important thing is I've watched a bunch of tape on him, but I want to meet the kid, find out what makes him tick, maybe share some memories, albeit 35 years apart. Can't wait. Big John. Mr. May, uh, how you doing, man? I'm doing all right. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. So I, this way I look at it is old school BC safety, uh, new school yeah. BC safety, right? Things, things a little, little bit has changed since you've been here. So what are you feeling about this whole draft thing? I mean, I'm excited, but uh, it's like having a baby. It's like <laughs> the day will never come. I'm just, I'm anxious. I'm anxious nervous, actually. Anxious and nervous. Anxious nervous? Yeah. Is that now, is that a word? Anxious nervous? Yeah. It should be. I heard it from Steph Curry, but they, I think they can throw it in uh, Merriam-Webster and <laughs> make it a word. So, John, when I was here, I was in Ron Colley Hall. What we loved to do was come down here on a nice day, hang out right over here, what we call the Ron Colley Beach. If you had to go anywhere on campus, you had to make your way this way. Right. So basically, the whole BC world walked by my beach. You're an 18 year old boy, and you've been in training camp for a month, and there's nobody on campus, and all of a sudden, Classes start, it's beautiful out, girls are actually here. Every girl looks like <laughs> Jennifer Lopez. <so. laughs> All right, we're gonna play a game, you ready? It's called Tip. Lynn Swan and John Stallworth taught me this in 1981. You get three tips, guys, okay? One, two, three, it's one hand at a time. You ready? Okay, here we go. Oh, I like that. Yeah. That's nice, this is cool. You gonna go, oh yeah! Oh, okay, yeah, now we're talking. Oh. <laughs> That's it. Got That's it. That was cool. We never had a bubble. Back in the day, we didn't have much. <laughs> we didn't have much. All right, so who are we meeting now? My defensive backs coach, Coach Cavanelli. What's he like? Best in the business. He's relentless. <laughs> oh, coach, relentless. <laughs> I love it, dude. Going? That's awesome, man. Yeah. What's up, man? What's going on? All right. Mm -hmm. So uh, give me a quick overview of what kind of football player this kid is. You know, the thing about John is, he can play a lot of spots. You know, he's tremendous on special teams. And the thing I think he has really more than anything is he's got tremendous ball skills. Give me a story about him and his personality coming through with you or the team. We have a senior night before the guy's last home game, and uh, John spoke to the team. I don't think there was a dry eye in the room um, because the guys on his team, they love John, and everything he says comes from the heart. He was emotional. I can just be myself around my guys, and, and it, it just meant a lot to me. So this is one of your spots, John, the reservoir surrounding Boston College, right? Oh, yeah. Just walk around, clear your mind on a beautiful day like this. So, I mean, it's beautiful. I can remember we had a workout where we had to, we started right here. We ran all the way around, we ran a few hills and ran all the way back. That was one of our early morning workouts. So, John, first of all, I thought it was awesome to get an opportunity to meet you. I'm BC proud. Always rooting for you. I'm happy to be in the community with guys like you, and uh, thank you for coming to visit. It's good to be here with you.